What's going on? Let's make some butter curd chicken. All right, so we're gonna need two to three pairs. First, we're gonna peel them. And once your pears are peeled, we're just gonna slice them up. Pears cut, and just slide them out the way. Now we're gonna slice up our butter. Now we're gonna slice up our butter. I'm using some good grass-fed butter today. I have found that grass-fed, or at least this brand of grass-fed, does have a lot more flavor than your everyday butter. So we'll cut some planks out of here. Cover a cheap tray in four. Gonna get our chicken out, and of course, we're gonna season with the AP season. Hey. Pay attention, or you're gonna open the wrong end. Chicken season, gonna sit it to the side. Bring our pan back into play. And we're gonna get some top of butter down. Gonna get some pears down. And we get the rest of our pears over top. And we're gonna cover it up. And you probably use less chicken in your boat. I'm gonna have to crimp these up to try to make sure it don't turn on, fill out. Then we're gonna go back over top of the middle. And now, we're going into a 375 degree oven for about 40 minutes. Come back. 40 minutes later, pulling that baby out. My pole didn't work. Some of the juices is spilling up. Let's see what's up in there. about another 15 minutes and like that we done get that bubbly goodness look at it let's get that chicken out there and look at them juices now be careful you want to leave your sides up you don't want your juices to spill out because we need them but we're gonna roll the chicken. Ooh, that's hot. Hold on. All right, got my tongue. So, first, we're gonna roll our chicken in there and then pull it out. We're gonna keep going till we get them all out. Get some of these pears out of their beautiful juice. Let's send them over top. All right, now we're gonna take our juices and the pears remaining over into this pan. 
You probably guessed it by now. We're gonna make a gravy. I already got your butter, so let's not overdo that. Then we're just gonna need about two tablespoons of flour, a whisk, It should be some white or mar or uh, sherry cooking one. I ain't got none. God dang it. I know y'all saying this man ain't never got what he need. But we just gonna do about a third of a cup of some cooking wine. I'm going red today. Just a little bit of the AP. And like that. We done. Plate. Chicken. Gravy. I'll garden as a side today. Y'all just enjoy that. 